him and Chan was arguably be the best in the game. Oh, so he needed the nerfs. Well, I don't think I think I think Capcom just doing the Capcom thing and they want views. Mm -hmm. So I saw this even on like when I was looking up on YouTube, mm -hmm. they just keep changing different characters to t for top tier so people would see different characters in that game. I guess. Oh, okay. As a marketing tool. Okay, nice. That's negative four on block. Yeah, a lot of people see me commentate, but you know I'm I'm like a walking um, um fat. That's the app tool with the frame data. Yeah. Like I know what I know my frame data for this game. And Chad decided that he's gonna go Colin yeah. just to troll. Yeah, Colleen. Colleen. Oh that's what that's how you pronounce the yeah, name. Colleen. Colleen. Okay. Yeah, that's that's Urian little things, you know. Yeah. I remember I, I actually sat down and watched like all of the cutscenes. Yeah, but but Colleen Colin's a, a bad she's a real thought, but she's dating you um Urian and she go on staff home with Gil. Woman like money and power, boy. <laughs> that's, a, that's another story for a different day. I did not even know that. So now we're going to figure out um, what Chad knows about this character. He was multi-talented with a bunch of other characters in, in Street Fighter 4, yeah. but I've only seen him use Armika in this version. Yeah. Unfortunately, he lost that skill. Yeah, to uh, like play multiple characters. Yeah, I think he's so Oh, sad. shit. Dove Extreme looking to take his first tourney. And we got your boy <laughs> coming in the building. Oh, we got, we got, <laughs> we got oh, oh, we got Mr. Fox in the <laughs> building. Mr. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Me out. Mr. 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 Facade. Oh, yeah, he come, he come though. <laughs> <laughs> he said he wasn't coming, but he came. All right. We got Fox in the building. <laughs> 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 we got Virgil. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Y'all. Uh, you know, we laughing about the commentary, <laughs> but we got to stay focused. Oh, and it looked like Dove Extreme <laughs> is... <laughs> uh, oh, wait. Lloyd came for Injustice. Okay, we post up Injustice. Yeah, we post up Injustice today, too. So I don't know how to look in. Fox play Injustice. He plays Injustice. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think Shah just experiment. Oh, nice counter! I think Shah just experimenting with with Colleen. Yeah. And her counters are just ridiculous. I think she was, oh, nah, she was inspiration for Geef counters. Mhm. Mm Damn. Okay. That's not even a tea bag. She don't want. She didn't even go that low. Hey, that's what I'm saying. That's not a tea bag. That's not a tea bag. <laughs> no. There's a person here for injustice. So no. the guy with the glasses. Yeah, came for injustice. Mhm. Mm Okay, here we go. Uh, I guess people, uh, well, Dub Extreme, whenever you watch this. It, it didn't come. It didn't come today. All right. Um. Yeah, like I said, Dub Extreme, when you watch this video, ooh, see there, there's a new animation for his Crouching Heavy Punch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. Ryu is Crouching yeah. Heavy? Okay. Good okay, nice. Confirm. One thing I could say about Dub Extreme, like he's picking and choosing the spots. Yeah. I don't see him like really being impatient, so he definitely has a competitive fighter mentality. Yeah, but he, he can't keep dashing and when you play against Shad, you're not gonna throw shot at that. It's the best to, to, to open him up, you gotta shimmy him. You just can't keep I don't think Dove Extreme knows how to utilize shimmy. Okay, big big damage. Okay, nice. Ooh. She did? Nah. Shad is very good at chip damage. So he I mean run, like forest run. Clutch, clutching. <laughs> <laughs> he trying to get him in the corner. How did I know that? I was like, this dude is trying to get him in the corner. <laughs> we got him? Yep. Uh, so this, the, the, the critical art went past the Hadouken. That's crazy. Well, that's one up, right? Yeah. 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 That's one, yeah. We got, that one. We got to blame Alex for not updating. I think Dr. Sherman won the first game. He won? No, 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 no. That was the first game now. This guy was one apiece, right? No, that was one. Oh, that was the first, first one. That, yeah, okay, okay, I was okay. watching. Okay, that's making sure. I know I wasn't tripping out. That yeah. was the first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know you, you. It would have been. I I wanted double okay, extreme nice. to take the game. That's a very good technique. What he just did. A lot of times when you cross up, when people um, like a lot of players, they always try to grab you. Mm -hmm. Light punch. Light punch. TP is actually throw invincible. So if you feel like someone gonna throw you, or the habit of doing that, that's a good way to you know counter that. He's doing a good job uh, throwing out um. Just a really long hitbox, yeah, just to keep him out. Because Colleen does doesn't have like any long range attacks. It seems, except that 
crouching. I don't know what that. Crouching, 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 medium kick. Okay. How do you know if it's medium kick, high kicks? Uh, basically, you just can tell by the recovery on it. <laughs> okay. Sweeps take longer to, to recover, so. Okay, so that had been a crouching. Wow. Ooh, we hit with the ugly oh fist. The ugly man. fist. <laughs> I don't want <laughs> your number. <laughs> just punch a crap out of just now. I mean, why would Shad just be disrespectful? Shad is like, I always got Armika if I end up being nice down. Nice mix up. I mean, you, you just have to kind of respect certain players, and he doesn't do that. He's not respecting Dove Extreme, who I feel as though isn't a total idiot. Okay, that was not a good string. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a bad B. B trigger. Ah. Ah. Yeah, Dove Extreme is not going to do too well with this one. He's going to have to kind of like prepare for the next yep, game. Yep, yep, yeah. yep, yep. In that situation, you just got to be like, okay, I need to figure out what, yeah, what he's doing. I mean, doing. The, the, that was kind of obvious because you look at the meter, stuff like that. It's kind of obvious, you know. Like I say, certain players, you, you can't really open up certain players in certain ways, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, to open shot up, you have to use a lot of, like, delayed delayed frame traps. <laughs> and we have Alice chuckling over here. <laughs> Mr. Chuckles. It is, Nick. <laughs> I always don't read this group because they're talking about shit now. Okay, let's get back to this. Okay. Dove Extreme Ooh. looking to take uh, W. Oh shit, that thing is. Yeah, but he could have killed kill him though. If he, after standing medium kick, what he did in the picture to confirm, he could have do standing heavy kick, standing heavy kick, light kick, DP in the super, that would have actually killed. Wow. He was still able to wrap it up. Yeah, like I say, like when you play, you gotta know your maximum punish. You gotta know your so, optimal so punish. That's, that's, the, that's the optimal punish for. Yeah, real. after that. Supposed to be in the standing. Can you repeat that again? Standing uh, after standing medium kick, mm -hmm. you press. Okay, we have a little error right here. Okay, but after standing, you still recording, right? Yeah, I still recording. Okay, after standing medium kick, you press V trigger, standing roundhouse or, or standing HK, mm -hmm. light standing light kick into heavy punch GP super. That would actually kill them. Wow, all right. I hope you heard that, Dove Extreme. That's what you can use. If you need to um, extend yeah, your combo, especially if you close and you got the the poke with the standing medium kick, that's one of real nice pokes. And you have V trigger, you could confirm into a lot longer damage than what you just did. So, yeah, it's just it's just like important knowledge. That's why I love to comment too. Right. Uh, yeah, important knowledge is um. Ooh, nice. That that goes a long way in uh, getting these players better. Because I would love to see this community like really you know push their meta. Yeah, it just it just takes time, you know. It's like yeah. like my father always told me when I was growing up, whatever you put in, that's what you can get that's out. That's what you can get out, right? And I 100% agree with that. People wonder why me or Sha or even Shaquille, right now, the reason why people just keep improving, improving, improving. But I say Shaquille even more because this guy grinding the Street Fighter Five hard now, so it's like. So I mean, and he needs to like display his. Skill yeah. a little bit more. Yeah, I, I think I, he's, I, I he's too settled on online and. I guess I mean online helped him a lot because he he grew it a lot faster mm -hmm. from just playing online, you know. Yeah, he also have constant access to um, other play. Oh, yeah, got the critical art. So I notice every time Colleen use the ice, mm -hmm. you you're you're like this weird color. Is that does that have some type of effect on um, your character? Whenever she hits you with the ice, mm -hmm. like with a V V trigger. It actually freezes your stun bar. That's why you, you turn into like the ice mode. Mm -hmm. You turn like Oh, blue. okay. So it actually it freezes your stun bar. So no matter what you do, no, notice like when you play now the stun bars is low. Whenever they get hit the stun bars would increase a little bit, like you see right here. Right, or decrease. Going up. Mm -hmm. But when she hits you with the husk V V trigger, it actually freezes freezes your stun bar. So if your stun bar is one tip away, and she freezes with you, she could walk back and, and wait as long, long as you, she want. And once she hits you again, it remains too stunned. So it only, it only freezes it from decreasing, but not increasing? No, it stops it completely. Okay. So if your stun gauge is half, okay, you press a button. No, 
Okay. Wow. Yeah, he Almost looked like he broke his block. Yeah, he does. Ryu, Denjin, Adokan does that. Wow. Okay, that's weird. I wonder if Shad knows that her stand, her crouching yeah. medium kick is plus two. <laughs> Damn, that freaking read though. Fine, that extreme. Finally, he does a DP. Finally. Yeah, he. And this DP is no longer trade. Finally, the, D, the DP has come around. But the, um, actually, I was playing the other day, and when well, I was playing again, mine still trade with, with like raw jumping hard punch or hard kick. Mm -hmm. Still trades. I mean, oh, it still trades. Okay. Yeah, they got to do something. But it doesn't trade if you're in V-Trigger. Oh, uh, Crapcom need to do something. Because even V-Trigger, no matter what, once it's not EX, sometimes it still does trade. So. Oh, oh yeah, it's EX, sorry. Yeah, EX has invincible, invincible frames from from startup. Okay, you see, oh, it ain't right. moving. I notice it ain't moving. And it now nah, goes away. Delve Extreme is doing a good job of actually landing a lot of grabs on Chad. It's like he's doing tomahawks. Do y'all call it tomahawks in this game where you do an empty jump into grab? Uh, we just call it empty jump grab. We don't okay. really call it a tomahawk. And Nelly and Smash they call it a tomahawk. All right. Uh, so Chad is up too. Oh, uh, that's two one. Yeah. Well, what he did was creative, though. He did um, jumping medium punch to uh, counter shot. The shot was doing his counter because mm -hmm. Cody have a, a counter. Mm -hmm. He was doing jumping medium punch. So when he jumps and it, it bait the counter out. Uh. So because when you do jumping medium punch with Ryu, it changes his hitbox to to aerial. That's normally first air to air. But good now, I see he... Yeah, but he, he forcing Chad to jump and just punish him yeah, and everything. Yeah, I see now he's throwing his DPs now, so that's that's pretty good. Yo, Dub Extreme, yeah, being, uh, noticing him to yeah, be that's, a very that's tight corner right there. Nice. Got him jumping, and now Chad is trying to force him. He just wants to get him in the corner. I'm I'm glad, like, Chad is the type of player that has, like, this strategy of putting you in the corner because it really teaches you how to deal with corner pressure. You need players that do that. That have really good con um, counter flash out, so that you could learn how to counter it. Yeah, I, th I think that's just the Mika in him. Ooh. Yeah. Because Colin, Colleen, doesn't look like she excels as much as um, uh, our Mika in the corner. No, not really. Yeah, I mean, but when you when you have a person who's inexperienced on the corner, yeah, that's the best place to help them. Because no, to, to the one that they're trying to look at the jump out, that's like, that's a read. I don't. Have, I don't even read that. That's like a, a certainty. See, you, you try. You try jump the corner by doing the tattoo. Yeah. So, once you have a begin a beginner player, or a player who just learning, that's the first tendency they, they do. Either they jump back or they try jump over the corner, and that's when you can either anti air or do whatever. Trap them there. Have you seen Dove Extreme using like these no tendencies to escape corner pressure? Well, yeah, he he, he did. The bleed there was good, but shot gave him a space to do it. He did the the tattoo to mm -hmm. escape the corner. But the top two has recovery frame, so that's the thing. Yeah, that dash up grab won't work. So, Dub Extreme, if you watch this video, two to one, you probably will. Because I see you're hungry to get better. Yeah. Or you have something called a shimmy. Shimmy is basically when you comes in the throw range and you go out of the throw range. Or you have a simple one. You could dash forward, dash back, and you could bait, bait the throw out and punish it. Yeah, but you, a lot of videos you can look online. I think I got some videos or whatever, you know, about the shimmy. Yeah, he really needs to learn shimmy. I think if he if he utilizes it into his current play style, it's going to be really good for him. He's the best Ryu main I've seen so far. No, um, uh, well, I think the best. I've I'm seen, not calling out your boy. The best I've seen is probably Bahama Jin. I played him recently. Oh yeah, Bahama Jin, right? I played him recently. Where where has he been? He dropped out of the group, and I've never seen. Yeah, him he since. told me he got some like, uh, guest appearance. I think it was last tournament, but I think some game up. I haven't talked to him since then, but I normally see him. I see him every so often now, like more fluently online. Mm -hmm. But he'll be a good person to help um, Demarco or the main Dub Extremo, saying that he's a real man. Mm -hmm. Demarco trying his yeah, nice. hardest to see Lindy and Shad trying to be as patient as possible. Yeah, that's, that's true. Because I feel like Shad may go Armika because he doesn't want to take the risk. I mean, I don't see no real competition no. for Shad to even see really. Yeah, sweat. I Unless, I mean, Minoko, yeah. 2-2. Two, 2-2. Two. Two, two. If you lose that, you go to losers. Huh? You could count a bit. Huh? <laughs> yeah, you would be in losers bracket. All right. Just trying to confirm that he was going to lose his bracket. Just in case he loses. So that means he acknowledged um, Dove Extreme. Yeah. 
But I don't want Dove Extreme to get too comfortable in that thought. I, I, I don't even want Shaggy to lose us because that means we can have a longer ground finals because he probably got reset set the bracket anyway. So yeah. No reset. <laughs> <laughs> you think the bracket will really take long? Yeah. I mean, we, we have... That's like seven matches. Oh, yeah. Three, because the first is three and then, then the next four one is four to seven. seven. So. All right. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, uh, Rhythm may not be too happy about that when I have to stream from this data. Uh, oh, Alex, so Michael Alex, has Alex, gotten Alex. the Alive phone. So we'll be streaming from his phone. Uh, finals. But I think he should invest in the fiber optic because now I think they're available to businesses now. Oh, okay. But I don't think he said he, he can't afford it. I think that's what uh, he's saying. The price is the same thing. For businesses and, and homes. It's when I spoke to them, I was there last week, Thursday, so it's the same thing. So yeah, he, he should him. definitely get that fiber optic then. So we could actually stream entire events rather than just streaming part of it. So you can see my face. My sexy face. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Shard, uh, up one. Playing a lot more defensive. Dub Extreme having a hard time dealing with this passive aggressiveness. Because I, I think Shad was playing a lot more offensive last time, and now. Yeah, he has playing more serious because he don't want to go lose so. Right. Makes sense. Okay, nice DP. Yo. Okay, nice. Oh, now he, he forcing the hell out of him right now. Dove Extreme. Oh, on the oh, oh. <laughs> oh, wow. This dude right now. Where did that come from? Straight out of, I can't say it on TV. <laughs> <laughs> Straight, Straight out of cap today. <laughs> I was like, where is this offense coming from, dude? This dude got momentum. He has what you call momentum. God damn it, look at the baits. He's being jibbated. Oh you oh you put yourself in that corner, bro. And luckily he isn't using Armika and you ain't, you can't get mixed up to pieces okay. in the corner. Okay, now he can't get out. Cause he used that tattoo and that press put him right there. Okay, nice punish. Oh nice punish it's Okay. Oh shit. This girl has no range on a grab, I can see that. Yeah, she look like a bear trying to hump over oh, DP. Nice. You yeah. should have used a regular one though. Okay, back to um, I could you could tell he study a lot of Daigo because really, yeah. You see how much he using his um projectiles to kind of like bait out stuff. He isn't just throwing them out there to to put damage out. Oh, yeah. that oh, that was a good that was a good block. Yeah. He <laughs> god damn, Dove extreme. Yeah, but I wouldn't advise him to throw throw fireballs because shock is super right true. Oh. Caught him jumping, um, dashing in. No fireballs, please. Okay, yeah, come on. Damn, he caught him slipping. That was extreme. Very good games, man. Very good games. I, I know he doesn't feel too good about that one, but he definitely played pretty good yeah, you know. for the most part. 